Hey guys, the objective of this video is to do another example using a grading curve to name a coarse soil under the Unified Soil Classification System. So once again, we've got particle size against percents finer. This will allow, sorry, we've also got the liquid limit and the plastic limit, and all this information will allow us to draw a soil grading curve where we just plot the corresponding points and join them up. So here would be our grading curve. The first thing we need to do, as always, is look at our flowchart and determine the amount passing through 0.075 millimeters. So if we come back to our table, this critical value of 0.075, 20% has passed through. So if 20% has passed through, it means 80% has been retained. So 80% of particle sizes greater than 0.075 millimeters has been retained which tells us we're dealing with a coarse material because the majority has particle sizes 0.075 millimeters. Okay, so we know we can come down this branch because we're dealing with a coarse material. We then need to work out whether the, ma the majority of what has been retained, so the majority of that 80%, is the majority of that sand or is the majority of that gravel. So we come to our grading curve and we highlight the sand spectrum and the gravel spectrum. So I'll do the sand in orange. So the sand ranges from 0.06, which is there, to 2, which is up there. So I highlight all that region. So that's all sand. 